If your team is building a design system, you can share assets like your colors, components, etc. across documents, allowing your team to design quickly and consistently. This way, your team can maintain a source of truth for your design system. So let's see how this works. With a design system open, you can click the Invite to Document button up here. Now the document needs to be saved as a cloud document if it isn't already. Clicking here, you can save it as a cloud document and rename it if you need to and save it. Once saved, you can then add emails of those you want to share the design system with. Then share it. With it shared, you can see who has access to the cloud document in the same window, and you can always easily add or remove people later. Now I'm going to switch hats here, and I'm going to be the person that was invited to the cloud document. I've set up a new project, and I need to use the design system content. So with the new project file open, in the Assets panel, you can click the plus here to link to a cloud document. I can choose a cloud document I have, a cloud document shared with me, or a sketch library to convert. I'll select the cloud document shared with me. The assets from the design system now show in the assets panel as linked. You can go in and apply the colors, the character style formatting, use the components, etc. Maybe you need to use a few of these components. So you can drag one or two out. And after doing so, you can still make local changes to the components. Those appearance properties override the master in the original source document. Now, in order to make changes to the component masters, the colors, the character styles, etc., you need to edit in the original source document. So you can right-click a component out in the document, or in the Assets panel, you can right-click a color or a character style and choose Edit in Source Document, or a component and choose Edit Master in Source Document. That'll open the original design system. You can make the change, and the updates will appear in your document. So let's show that. I'm back in the design system and suppose that I've gotten some brand guidance from internal clients and I need to make some changes here. I'll edit one of the components that was dragged out into the project. I'll make a simple edit here. And once the file is saved, any document that links to this will show a notification. So let me go back over to the project file. You can see it here. And if you move a pointer over the link icon, you can see the difference. It'll show you the update. If you want to update just this one asset, you can click the link icon, or you can click Update All down here. You can also just choose to ignore the change and work with the version of assets that are currently in the document. Sharing a design system is really a great way to be able to create a source of truth for your project and make it so that your team can design quickly and consistently and make sure that everything's up to date.